welcome back to another video. It's your girl, Mrs. Emily Paints, and today I'm going to be doing a video with the 35S Sweet Oasis palette by Morphe. And I'm going to be showing you guys how to create this pretty sparkly look with some glitter. So if you're into makeup tutorials, remember to subscribe. Also, leave a comment down below and like this video. And yeah, you guys, follow along. Okay, the first thing we're going to do is we're going to use the shade Private Villa and we're going to apply this on our crease. We're going to do side to side motions and circular motions. I only took a small amount of eyeshadow because pink can get very messy and since it's very bright, I'm going to be building the color up. So I'm starting off with this shade first. Next, I'm going in with the shade Picture Perfect, and I'm gonna be applying this on my crease, but just make sure that you don't go above the first shade that we just applied because we don't wanna cover that up either. So just go side to side and little circles like I'm doing right now, and apply small amounts of product so you don't make a mess. Next, I'm going in with the shade Vineyard Escape, and I'm going to be applying this on my crease as well, but I'm going to lean more towards the bottom of my lid. So if you guys can see, I'm pressing it onto that area, and I'm starting off on the outer corner because this shade is very dark, and it can get patchy if you don't know how to blend it right. So let's do windshield wiper motions and circular motions to make sure it looks as blended as possible. Now I'm going to be cutting my crease and I'm using a foundation to do this just to give it a smoother look. A lot of you that have been watching my videos know that this is what I've been doing lately. So I'm going to be using the Beauty Creations Flawless Stay Foundation to cut my crease carefully. And I'm using a flat brush to do this, you guys. Now I'm going in with the shade Revel It In and I'm going to be applying this all over the crease and then we're going to be going in with some glitter. Now don't go anywhere because I know makeup artists don't tell you this step when you do eyeshadow and I'm going to tell you so don't go nowhere. I'm going back in with the first shade that I used and I'm applying it on the outer corner just to cover up that harsh line from our cut crease. Now I'm going to be doing the same with the shade Picture Perfect. This was the second one that we used and I'm only grabbing a small amount and I'm just going to be moving this side to side and make sure that it looks more blended. Now I'm going to be going in with the last color which was Vineyard Escape and I'm going to be applying it on the exact same spot and just blend it even more. As you guys can see the look is coming together and we don't have that harsh outer corner line so so far so good. Stay with me we're almost done you guys. Now it's time for the fun part. We're going to be applying some glitter and I'm using the duo glue. You can get this on Amazon, you guys. It's very cheap. I think it's like two of them for 
so this is my favorite i use it for my eyelashes as well and for the glitter i'm using the one called sweetheart from inolvidable cosmetics and i'll link it down below in the description for you guys and i'm just gonna be patting this onto that area where i applied my glue as you guys can see it's not as hard as it looks but i will tell you that it is very uncomfortable to wear glitter on your lids a lot of people don't tell you this i know but it's very uncomfortable and to remove to remove this it hurts <laughs> i use some um makeup remover towels from neutrogena and it's so painful so i recommend you use oil like the oil based makeup remover um stuff because it hurts <laughs> After we're done applying the glitter, I'm going in with the darkest shade I used, Vineyard Escape. And I'm just going to put some on the outer corner so that it blends in with the glitter. Now I'm using the Italia Deluxe Eyeliner to apply on my waterline. Now I'm going in with my eyelashes in the style George. These are from my cosmetic line. Here is the website if you guys want to go get them. Also, one more thing, if you guys want to ask me questions while I'm live, go follow me on TikTok. This is the name exactly the same as it is on here. And I usually go live every single day while I'm filming my tutorials so you guys can ask me all these questions that you guys probably have. So yeah, ladies, you reached the end of this makeup tutorial. So if you enjoyed it, please give this video a thumbs up and comment down below the word pink. If you're a real one and you watch this all the way through, remember to subscribe and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.